I want to talk to you guys about meetings that you have with your lawyer. This is something I do a lot of with my clients, and I want to share this information with you, how I like to structure these meetings so that you can really save money with your lawyer and have the most productive possible meeting. So a couple um, tricks I'm going to share with you. First of all, do all of your meetings face to face. If it can't be in person because of COVID or whatever, do it over Zoom. So much better than doing it by phone. There's such a better connection that's made. Second tip, bring a helper. If it's not me, it's your mom or your best friend. Have another set of ears there with you and make sure those ears are part of your very inner sanctum and let your lawyer know that they're there. They should be part of that Zoom meeting. And my third tip is to create an agenda ahead of time. And this is the most important tip of all. Recently, I did an amazing one hour meeting with my client and her lawyer. She was a little reluctant to do this because she didn't want to pay for the lawyer fees. And she felt like a million bucks afterward because it helped um, lie out the roadmap that's in front of her. So she knows exactly what to expect and it enabled us to strategize. And the key is to keep the agenda tight and do it ahead of time and send this all to the lawyer. So what is in the agenda? It's a document, it's a written document. The first thing are to reiterate your divorce goals. What are the three to five things that you wanna walk away with and make happen so that you can consider this a successful divorce? And that way everybody is on the same page and striving for the same goals. It's a nice refresher for your lawyer. Next thing that you wanna put on this document is an update of any current issues that are happening. How are the kids doing? How's parenting going? How is communication going? Any problems that you're currently facing goes in your update of issues. Third thing on your agenda, questions you have for your lawyer right now. And the last thing on your agenda is something that you write as you're having the meeting and that's your strategy going forward. Now that your lawyer has remembered your goals and is aware of the current issues you're having, how are we gonna put out all the fires right now? How are we going to get ready for our next court appearance? What's coming up? What can I expect financially uh, or in terms of time commitment? And what is our strategy to make my goals actually happen?